Hi, this is Tomáš from Alerty team. This print, I finally finished my pull request to Atomic command. Uh, so the pull, re pull request implements installation and uninstallation of standalone containers. So this means that you will be able to install a container image and all the files which are meant to be uh, put on host will be tracked by RPM. So in order to perform a demo of this functionality, I also started my work on my other card, which is to pl provide a playground for everyone to try uh, modularity and installing modules uh, and such. So this is my first prototype and right now it only supports installation and uninstallation of uh, images via Atomic. So in future or in the next sprint I'm planning to extend this to also install modules and eventually even install container images via DNF, not via Atomic. So let's try it out. So first thing you need to do is to build the environment. So the ben, uh, environment is just a Docker container running systemd inside. So it's built and we can run it. As you can see, this is the Docker run really long uh, command. And afterwards, we just use Docker exec to create bash inside this container. So we can see that uh, the systemd is indeed running inside. Okay, so let's uh, let's use the guide from the README and let's install uh, nginx. As you can see in this step, uh, the RPM was built and right now it was installed with all the files uh, meant for a host. Uh, so they are now installed and we can list them. You can see that there's a bunch of files. There's also the systemd unit file. So we can actually start the service. So Nginx is now running and we can check its status. Uh, it's indeed running. We can open it in browser. And if you remember standalone containers, so they are using host uh, network namespace, so this is indeed running on localhost and not inside network namespace of a container. Uh, so my my plans for next sprint is to, as I said, is to extend this playground to also su support installing modules. Right now it's also based on Fedora 26 image. I'd like to base it on base runtime image, so we have the full modular environment uh, inside this playground. That would be all. Thanks for watching.